Hello everyone, welcome back to day number 23 of the 25 Days of Christmas DIYs. I want to thank everyone for um, welcoming my dad yesterday. He enjoyed himself. And um, let's get to day number 23. Let's say hello to everybody that's here already. Let's go back up to the chat. Uh, we got... Oh, you guys been chatting. Liz, Larry, Robin, Constance. Uh, let's see. I think that's it. Jason. Okay. Um, anybody else? I hope I'm not missing anybody. Steve. And... I think that's it. So, hello, everyone. Welcome to day number 23. Are you guys tired of seeing my face so far? <laughs> Hi, Gina. Was it you that said your, your mom's birthday was today? I believe it was you. R remind me if I'm if if I'm if I'm not um, thinking about that. I think it was it was Gina. Let's see. Yes. Well, happy birthday to Gina's mom. <laughs> I've had fun too, Liz. And um, if you guys hold, hold, give me a second here, I, I got one more row, and we, I'll show you what I've been what I've been working on right here. I've been wanting to get some gingerbread colored yarn for the past month. So I want to make a gingerbread little dude that I saw online. And then when Robin asked for a gingerbread um, skate yesterday, I'm like, I need to go get some. So I went and got some yarn today. So look, Robin. I made a... Hold on a second. I need, I need it. Here we go. There you go. I just finished that right now. There you go. So I'll finish that later. <laughs> so I got this big old ball of yarn at, at Joanne. I mean, not Joanne, Michael's. I wanted a different color, but the shelves are empty. There's there's not as, as, as much yarn as it, I guess, with, with the holidays and stuff. So I got what, I, what, what, what they had. This one's called um, Toasted Almond by the craft smart um this is the, the michael's um brand okay gina hi cheryl yay you finally caught it live speaking of lives um I'll, I'll get a schedule out and post it later but i was thinking of going live mondays wednesdays and friday in the new year and i haven't decided how i'm going to what kind of DIYs I want to do those days, or if it's just going to be, you know, chatting and crafting, or or exactly what, or maybe I'll do one of those days, um, one of my miniatures and then something else. So we'll, we'll see. So let's um get to number twenty three. That would be this guy here. Why do I always get scared? Wait a minute. Why is this empty? Tomorrow's 24 and 25, right? So it's 5, 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 20. There's something here. Did I take it out yesterday without knowing that I took 23 out? Uh-oh. What do we do, guys? Day 23 is empty. Did I forget to put one in there? <laughs> no problem, Larry. Um, what do we do, guys? Yeah, we could we could tag team Robin. Every other day, you and me. Um 
because I don't want to open these two because those are the, to tomorrow, tomorrow's boxes. I did open yesterday. Maybe I, I need to go back one day. Maybe. Ah, oh, that's what it was. I skipped a day yesterday. <laughs> Hi, Sandra. Yesterday I did 23. That now today I'm gonna do 22. <laughs> I'm sorry, I, I can't do this. This is too much work. A, tum a mini tumbling tower blocks. <laughs> Unless I do it with, 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 uh, with the, let's see. That's just a lot of work to do. I can do it with the, um, hold on a second. I can, it won't be mini. It will be using the quarter inch um, dowels and just cut them. So th this is this is just going to be cutting cutting cutting. Hmm. Gingerbread what? Cuz I, I know either tomorrow well either the 24th or the 25th is going to be the mini mini drum and I don't want to take that take that up cuz I I want to take my time on that one. What do I do, guys? Mm -hmm. Hold on a second. I have this. Hold on. Where is it? Hold on. Where is it? Uh, I'm looking for a cookie cutter. Hold on. I thought I put it back here. Oh no, I know where it is. Hold on. I know. This guy. I can make this out of my Pollard McClay. What do you guys think? Yes? No? Maybe? Uh, Hi, Shay. Hope you're staying warm. So should I? I won't. I won't be able to put it together because I have to bake it. But maybe while, while this is baking, I work work on something else. No. So what do we do? I don't have anything else on my list. Make what I want. See, so I, I think what's in and and these two is a, a mini drum and a polymer clay turkey. It's the last two that are missing. Let me let me see. <laughs> Do you, you really think that the, uh, uh, a gingerbread carousel is easy, Robin? Yeah, more than a couple hours. I don't have that much time. That, that two and a half hour that took the, the little um, lantern took a lot out of me. Oh, I made I made um, a little pom-pom out of this yarn. And I found this yarn that I bought. See what I'm saying? I bought this years ago. Isn't that pretty? It's, it's five different yarns. And it's, a, it's called the Pantone and Karen. See, I, I got it on clearance. So I thought it was... But I never used it. I don't know how to make no horse. I'm gonna see what kind of what kind of clay I have. Let's 
see what I'll do is cut cut what I have and while it's baking I can finish the skates um here we go I have this ooh this is this is I think it's okay I need to get the okay that should be enough I think and if anything, I, I'll just have to paint it because I don't have brown. Don't worry, Robin, when you least expect it. I'm just squeezing it. I wanted to sh show you the, the tray I had of, of my polymer clays from Hippie Crafter. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? But um, the Hippie Crafter um, blocks of polymer is too small for this, so... I'm using a, an old Sculpey one that I have. What do you mean, um, Liz, a pop stick wreath? Do I need to, do I need to Google it? Don't mind the mess I'm making over here. Hold on a second. Um, where did I put the handle? I'm looking for the handle for my pasta maker. Oh, here it is. I got it right here. Let's Mini presents, Robin. I guess you want a 10 minute video? Because I'm going to do is just get some blocks and get, cover them up. So let's get some, um, some parchment paper. I need to get a tile. The, the it's it's nicer with the with the tile. The 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 polymer clay won't stick. Okay, this guy. I want to uh, complain that a lot of these machines are not making for left-handed people. Very, very upsetting. So I don't know. Mini jars filled with candies. What kind of candies? I don't have no mini jars. The only mini jar I have is this one. And it's going to be a little gnome house that I'm, I'm working on. That's the only mini jar I have. I'm trying to... Need to warm this up to stick it through the machine. Because this... I haven't touched this clay in years. Let it go. Nope, it's too hard to go still. Just taking little bits and pieces and conditioning it. There we go. I took my rings off because I don't like I don't want clay in between. I don't know. I use the sheets because it's easier. I don't want to you know they come out. It's, it's just easier for me to so I don't know I, I have the 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 roll of parchment paper somewhere around here too I'm trying to see what else I have.
Of course they are, Larry. I know we're in we're our right minds. Always. I don't know if you guys can hear the 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 the, the bass of the neighbor's music. Oh, I forgot these rings. Whew. But the neighbors are at it again. It's Friday. It's like clockwork. I'm gonna flatten it out to put it through here. Um, can I tell you something, guys? This is the first time I've used this pasta machine. And guess what? It's over 20 years old. Last year, I tried to sell it, sell it online, but I'm going to make the little gingerbread house. I may have to paint it because this is the clay I have. So I'm going to use the, hopefully have enough to make the, use the cookie, cookie cutter. If not, I'm, I'll make my own. I even bought some, this is what I went, I got some liquid Sculpey along with the yarn today. Uh, focus. Oh, goodness gracious. There we go. This is liquid polymer clay. So if we need it, we have it. Oh, you don't want to see these. I can't put anything on my door, Gina. So, it would be no fun for me to make something that I can't use. Like those those fancy candles. Hey, Mike. The little, you know, blinged up candles. I ended up giving them to my mom. Because I don't use those. I made them because I, I wanted to step out of the box and my mom has a ton of stuff that I've made her to hang on her door so I don't know Tracy but I I, I don't know if I want to do that before the clay is dry because um, you're going to put it in the oven so I don't know if, if, if the acrylic will crack or not so, right now we're just doing this. And like I said, while it's baking, we'll work on something else. Because uh, right now, what I'm going to do is just cut it and stick it in the oven. So that way we can put it together. Mr. Greg! You missed it yesterday, Mr. Greg. I did the skates that you you um suggested. Yeah, I'll show you. Here, let me grab. I made ice skates yesterday. That's one of them, and then the other one. I made it with um some some brown felt because Robin wanted some gingerbread ones, so I made those. And they're hanging on the on the on the tear tray right now. Oh, that neighbor is annoying. What kind of what kind of door ornament are you talking about, um, Gina? Yeah, I'm using polymer clay today, Mike. Thank you, Greg. I'm just conditioning the clay so I can go through the... Oops. Through the pasta machine here. Because this clay is 
all this dirt. We're just putting it through here. I'm just stacking them. We're conditioning the clay to make it. Yes, I like them. This is the first time I, I've seen those skates um, before, you know, over the years, and I've never made one. And it probably took less than five minutes to make. So I mean, like, why didn't I make them before? So as, as you can tell, right here now, I'll go back up here. So we have the skates hanging. We got the wreath. We got the little pom pom balls. I even made an itty bitty one. My crochet um, lights. So everything's um, out of yarn up here. I have to rearrange it. Yeah, make it where where it's it doesn't turn like that. There we go. Thank you. I think I got this. I think I five below. And um, I um, stained it. You see these snowflakes all around here? They're not from the shirt. There's a spot right here that I put a snowflake on. It didn't look right, so I put them all over the place. So uh, that's HTV. Some of it's coming up. I have to um, re-iron it. Mike, this is, I've done polymer clay before, but nothing very extravagant. So, um, I've I took a class on creative fabrica, which I'm I'm gonna be doing a video after Christmas. So that's that's gonna be something that I'm gonna be working on. I'm gonna be making um, a mini. Um, gnome house using this baby food jar so it's gonna have like full wood and all that cool stuff let's we'll see how that works out and you gotta condition this and condition it until it, it gets to the what, what you how you on this thing it's just a pasta machine you, you can't hurt yourself it's manual Hey, this is my first time using it, and all I'm doing is, is pushing the the clay through there. And it's, it's too thick, so we're gonna stick it back out. <laughs> Lightening that out a bit. And to roll it out, you get you got the acrylic roller. You see, it's I've had this for years too. Look, look at the tip, the the edges. It's fallen. It's supposed to be nice and flat like this one, but for some reason it it's, it keeps on falling on that. Roll it with the pin first. Okay, this one. We're thinking the same, Mike. I think that should that should be flat enough but I don't think I have enough of this enough of this um clay to do the whole house we'll see you can get it at Michael's or online like I said I've had mine how long that is who knows? Maybe I can do it in pieces. Oh, yeah. oh, I have enough. Yeah, we have enough. But I don't know if this is too thin. Hmm. The right hand stop quick when the left hand is getting hurt. <laughs> Look how long that is. Nice and flat through that pasta machine. What I want to do is, is, is just condition it with the pasta machine. It makes it easier. And then we'll, we'll roll it out with the roller. 
and this has this right here this knob where you can get get it thinner or or, or actually let's see if i can get it fatter so that i want it fatter than this for the for the for the whatchamacallit so we're at a two let's see does it which way it goes Does it turn? How does it turn? Do I pull it out? Oh yeah, pull it out and turn. That's that's okay. A oh, one is the fattest one that you can put them here. Travioli. What waterfall tables? <laughs> I wish this would stay in, but I think that they make it so you could, you know, break it down and put it away. I think we 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 got something here. Move this to the side. Move my rings to that side. Nice and yeah. <laughs> I guess the, the the more you push the, this machine, do that, the the softer this gets, and it makes it makes it more pliable. So we're going to let's start with the top here. And then we'll see what what we have left over. And hopefully we can get all four walls in the roof. I'm gonna cut this away. Cut that away. There's one. Actually, I need to press this one a little bit more because it has a door. Very balanced um, meal, Robin. Nuts and fudge. <laughs> See here? It cuts the little door out. You, have to look, you have to still have the door in there. I'm not sure how you're supposed to get that out. Let's go get a pokey tool. Okay, too. Oh, uh, me and epoxy don't 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 want to. You, you keep the door if you want to decorate the door and open it up or something. Now we're going to do. Let's see. Up here we can do the side walls. I think we got we got enough. Let's see. Oh, let's move this guy over. Go up a little high there. Did I miss something? Oh, was it a nice um, gesture or, or were you scared, Robin? Here's the two sides. Now we're going to do the roofs. Or the roof. You loved your husband that, that much, Robin? You gave it to him? Now we're going to do this. By the way, guys, I've never used this cookie cutter before either, so I've had this for about three years. Those are the extra pieces to the side, and then the 
button. There we go. That's my husband's alarm, and he's not waking up. Honey, uh, the alarm is off. What time is it? 6.30. Okay. They're saying there's aliens in my house. Yeah. yeah. I'm just moving the edges from the, the cookie cutter so it doesn't look like it. So we got one group. <laughs> Liz, that's funny. Uh, he's so tired, Robin. I don't think any alarm would wake him up. Only his wife. And he's like, what, what? What, 6.50? Okay. We've got that side. Got the two. And what I'm doing, I don't know if you see the... Let's see. Can you tell? The edges right here in the back. So I'm just flattening that out to make it even with the front. So put that there. Looks like a doggy house. <laughs> I don't think nothing will do that for him. He he just too tired from all his jobs. So we're gonna bake the door too, just in case we use it. Really, Larry? An air horn? Maybe I need that, need one of those to wake him up. So we're going to put this to the side over here. Move my rings. I'm just going to fold it so that I don't need that, that whole thing in there. Okay. We got the two side walls. One of the side walls is a little wonky, but hey, we'll, we'll, we'll work. Here we go. We got the front, we got the back, we got the itty bitty door, and we got the two roof panels. Turn it this way. Okay, I'll be right back. I'm going to stick this in the oven. Don't worry, I'm right there. That's baking, guys. Uh, 6.35 takes about 20 minutes. So 6.55. Okay. Next project. I need to find a little bag for this. We'll find one. Oh, yeah. I, I know where my little bag is are.
Okay. Thank you, Tracy. I'm not making a carousel, Robin. You make the carousel. I want to see all your little horses. Oops. Hold on. That's up to the ground. Just putting it in plastic so it doesn't dry up too much. I'm sorry, it's, it's not hot chocolate if you don't have marshmallows in them. Nope, 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 nope. So we're going to put our rings back on. I have the big hip on my wedding ring now. Look at this. It just slides right off. The other day my hands were, were wet and I did this number with it and my rings just fell off. So I got to be careful. I had to switch this one because the one I had before um, fell off. So this one's a little smaller. So I like silver rings, so I may have to go in and see what I can find that's smaller. Where did you, I get what? I don't know what you're talking about, Robin. You, you you need to finish those sentences when you're when you're on here, cause I'm not sure. What are you talking about? I have some cr Christmas gifts to, to do, but um I don't want people to see what I'm doing, cause they might be watching. So I do not want them to see it, and we're. Hold on a second, guys. I need to go for something. Here we go. Look at that, that fuzzy yarn. <laughs> Big, small, doesn't matter, um, Larry. As long as you have some marshmallows in there, you, that's some good hot chocolate. To me, it doesn't matter. Ooh, the, the hard candy canes or that or those soft candy canes? Which one? Yes, I'm... I'm I'm doing better with, with what I'm eating and, and stuff, but every once in a while, you, you can have a little treat. You don't, don't overdo it. Like today, I had some grapes. And, I, and, and my body said, okay, that's enough now. Hi, Miss Tinkerbella. I've been diabetic since 2003, so almost 20 years. So I'm just doing the little fuzzy on top of this one like I did the other ones. And I'm doing this because I started it and I have to finish it. <laughs> it is hard. Oh, you had you did um hard pick candy cane. I like those soft peppermints. Those are cool. You never ate a candy cane, Mike? You 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 poor de deprived person. I am so sorry about that. That you're so deprived. We're, we're gonna have to, you know, take care of that for you. Send me your address. I'll send you some peppermints. I mean, some candy canes. I heard you, honey. You wanna turn that off and I'll and I'll wake you up. Mm 
Okay. This guy is done. See, not, not, nothing to it. And my gun didn't shut off today. Woohoo! Sorry. Okay, it's preheated. We've got another 10 minutes. Like I said, I'm just doing hot glue in the back. If, if you, since I'm covering the back with um, felt, it doesn't really matter how, how you hide the tails. Usually you, you, you weave them in and out so you don't see the tails, but like I said, You can just um, glue them back here since we're going to hide them. Oh, the music is annoying. I think I might be having to, to call the popo on him again. Seaside Rock? I don't know, Mike. I don't have one here to, 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 to try it out, to, to, to explain how, what it tastes like and what it sounds like. I have a bunch of fake stuff. Because <laughs> if I had a bunch of peppermint, I'd be eating it now. I like peppermint, especially in the, in the winter time. I used to make a peppermint um, cake. I used to crush peppermint. I used to um, crush peppermint and stick it inside a cake mix, and then crush peppermint and stick it stick it inside the the frosting, and then eat it all up. That was good cake. But it's not good for you. Do you guys hear that that thump thump? I'm just trimming off the there's the first one there we go don't forget tomorrow I'll be on at noon and we're going to do day 24 and 25 and from the list that we had at the beginning, what's left is the, the dr mini drum and the things, the polymer clay turkey. So we'll be doing turkey again. You know what? We'll do the turkey first. That way we can bake it while we do the drum. And then the, the turkey be, be ready to show off. There's hot glue. Oh, yeah. I pressed the, the glue down with my crochet hook. Yes, noon. I have a party at five, Robin, or five or six. I'm doing two DIYs tomorrow. And I I I don't plan to be rushing home rushing home to do to do it. Which way is it? This way. So I decided to go on at to, at noon. That way I'll get have enough time to do both DIYs. Before I go to the party. And uh, next year, you know, Monday was in the Fridays. I have it at six. I'll send you a message. I don't know, Steve. I was thinking of doing it all together. Because the, the thumbnail says 24 and 25 on it. So. Oh. 
I just didn't want to go live on on Sunday. That's that's my family time. And tomorrow at the end, we're going to be doing a drawing for the $25 gift, totally dazzled gift card that they sent me. You can do that, Robin. But I've been going live every day for 24 days. Now, or tomorrow will be 24 days. And my husband has off from both jobs on Sunday. So we're going to spend some time together. Because usually he's sleeping or working. It's been a very, very, very busy month for him. And for me doing all these lives, getting things ready. Let me get my calendar to let you know which is. <sighs> Sorry, Robin. I won't start my lives next year until the Monday, the 9th. I'm taking that week off. The first week off of New Year's, I'm taking it off. So my first live will be January 9th at 6 p.m. Yeah, we're, go we're going to the, the family party on Saturday, which is tomorrow. That's why I'm going, going on earlier. Because that way all of us are together at one time. And then on, on Sunday, everybody goes to their in-laws and friends and all that other good stuff. But we, 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 do, we do go off, go to my parents' house and drop off some gifts. I'm sorry, Steve. But do, we, do you enjoy doing that? Hmm? That's the question. Do you enjoy it? Because if you enjoy it, it's not really work, is it? Or is it? <laughs> Good night, Jason. Thank you for coming. For some reason, this one came out. A stitch shorter. Why? Don't tell anybody, okay? What video you need to finish up, Robin? Actually, that's what, what I, I'm going to be doing the first week in, in January. Is getting some um, videos edited. And stuff. The BB craft one. I gotta do my glow bland. I have to do some other ones. So busy, busy in the in the new year. Let me go. That's not gonna work. Oh no, we don't want that. No negative. No, no, don't don't send no negative down here. Please don't send no negative. Nancy Nancy won't be able to take it. 
I've been a South Florida girl since I was four years old. So, mm -mm. I saw snow in nine. When did I see snow? In 2003 was the first time I saw snow. Well, I, not the first time because I was four years old when I left New York, but I don't remember any of that. So as an adult, in 2003 is when I remember snow. It was raining here this morning. I think that's usually right, right before... Um, I think this is shorter also. Nancy's not paying attention. You know that, guys? Yeah, Nancy, Nancy's not paying attention. Let me go get the, the, the gingerbread out of the oven. Here we go. I'm gonna let that cool down. Oh, the door. The door had a little piece on on it. Oh, we we'll use it to the back for the back of the door. So th these are a little warm and it's still a little soft. So once they cool down, oh, it's hot. Why didn't Nancy touch it? I don't know. <laughs> Let's slide that over there. We're going to fix this one because it's too short. Nancy cut it off too too soon. So we're going to attach a piece. Let's move this over here so I don't get my yarn inside of it. That's all I need. Some extra fiber in my coffee. How do you guys like to, to have your coffee? Or take your coffee? How does that work? I'm new to coffee drinking. Because... Um, since, since I, I, I took my caffeine away with my Diet Coke, I needed some something to keep me awake. Or, you know, alive. So, I'm, I'm new to, to it. My husband found some sugar-free hazelnut creamer. And we use stevia. He did find some um, pumpkin spice, but the pumpkin spice was not sugar-free, so my sugar spiked. You don't drink um, coffee, um, Steve? Is that what you're trying to say? I don't understand. That's what I'm, I'm getting from that. I think my, 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 my Fitbit watch is... Um, Counting my, my steps but by me moving my hand. I'm still still getting used to the, the the flavor, Steve. Like I said, I wasn't much of a coffee drink. I love the smell of coffee brewing. Oh, that's, the coffee brewing smells so good. But um, how how you say it? I like a little bit of coffee in my creamer. <laughs> it, it, it's just a, a, enough to tie me over. But I, I didn't I didn't do so bad with um with um how you call it quitting um cold turkey with a diet coke. I, I thought I was gonna have massive headaches, but it, it didn't. I think it's the first two days I had headaches, but 
the rest of the time I, I didn't so bad. So well, that's what I, I want to try, um, Mike, some cappuccino. So I, I don't know. One of these days we'll, we'll get a fancy coffee maker that can do all that stuff. You know that what it, what it, where what what is it called? Foams and milk and all that cool stuff. I have my a, a little mini Starbucks in my house. I still warm. I might use super glue to put those together because I don't think hot glue will hold it very well. You're this way, so you got to be that way, right? This way. So I need to put all these little tails to the back on the other side. So that's what I'm doing. I'm taking all the tails that were on this side to the back right here. So we can glue this to the back. Steve. Oh, I was wondering why my glue gun wasn't getting in the cradle. My mask was in the way. Really, Steve? How would you know what your dog left behind <laughs> if it tastes like that? Are you doing something you're not supposed to? Huh, Steve? <laughs> I'm going to decorate the panel, paint the panels first. And then assemble it. Because it'll probably be easier to, to, to decorate it while it's flat. So we're going to paint it first with the chocolate brown paint. And then we'll get some of the puffy paint and decorate it. And then we're going to use the super glue gel. To put it together and here are the skates it's, this is still a little warm so we're going to get the what is that the puffy paint to decorate these guys real quick while those are still I don't. I don't want to put um, acrylic paint on it while it's still warm, because I'm not sure how it's gonna react, and then I don't want to start all over again. Because I don't have. It's almost. Let me flip them this way, so the bottom can cool off. Yeah, a few more minutes. I'm gonna get this guy here. Shake, 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 shake. Um, test it out over here. Okay. And close it so I don't get my hand in it. Wasn't Sandra here early? Did I say Sandra or not? No. If I didn't, hello, Sandra. I thought I saw Sandra earlier. Yeah, I, I, I don't drink that much coffee. I, I, it's mo mostly like one or two cups. And they're 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 itty bitty cups. Like I said, it's, it's mostly um creamer. <laughs> Ooh, what kind of soup? I like soups.
What kind of soups do you guys like to to eat or drink? How you going? Or make? I need to fix that right there because this the whites showing we got four buttons and two buttons. One button, two buttons, and then four buttons. One, two, three, and four. Okay. Thank you, Liz. We're just making these because um we're waiting for the gingerbread to um to cool down before we start decorating it. We're just adding some decoration. So we're gonna go make a little, little diagonal lines. And to, to add the peppermint to this, we're gonna get the red puppy paint and put it in between. And that'll be our peppermint. Because I, I went to Michael's and the line was crazy. And when I went to the front and asked where, where the the full sprinkles are, they said the scrapbook area. I'm like, I didn't even think to go there. Plus, so I, did, I wasn't planning on going back to the scrapbook section and um, waiting in line again. No, that's not. That, that's what Nancy was not doing. And the traffic out there was ridiculous. OMG. Something that should have taken us 10 minutes to get to from, from the Target uh, Michaels area to home took us over 30 minutes. So that's crazy. Say crazy, I tell ya. Oh, you're going to make some chili for Monday night? Mm. Potato soup. Too. I've never had potato soup. You like kale soup or pumpkin? Cheryl is making potato soup right now. Love all kinds of soups and stews. Liz says, all of them are yummy. Yes. Chicken dumpling. Cringy. Oh, my goodness. All those sound good. All those soups sound really good. You guys are making me hungry. And I already had dinner. So I'm, I made the heel look like a sort of like a peppermint. There's the. Me. Come on. What, what, can you, for one day, focus for me? Actually, this, it looks weird this way. Let's put it back this way. There. there we go. This little dot. Wait, this little dot here. I'm gonna paint it to, to disappear or hide it because it's not supposed to be there. So those are those are dry. I'll go into my drying area because, like I said, puppy paint takes a while to dry. So I'm gonna stick them over here. Stick this over here. Now we got to paint our gingerbread. Shake, shake, shake. Why, YTFP, Chris? Hello. Do we know you? Do I know you? Heck. <laughs> Already painted my hands, of course. Okay, Tracy. We should be here another, I say, 30 minutes. I say that, but you, you never know. So we're going to turn these the right way because there's a good bad side and the bad side. That's a good side. That's a good side. That's a good side. And that's a good side. So we're going to get our brushes. Brush, brush, brush.
And if you use um, polymer clay that's, that, that's gingerbread color, you don't have to do this. I, I'm doing this because I didn't have gingerbread color paint. And you might have to do like two or three coats to cover the, this whole thing. And look, it's pretty hard. I'm going to just hold it down with right there. I should have done a, pr a primer coat, but I don't have. Uh, we'll, we'll continue. We'll just do two or three coats. And and this this is giving it a texture like it like it was wood. <laughs> That's interesting. We got wood paddling here. Yay. Huh? Yay, wood paneling. Would, would you like the guys like to see an, another 25 days of Christmas next next Christmas time? Thank you for coming, Greg. Merry Christmas. Stay warm. Everybody stay warm. You don't know. Everybody's gonna be cold. Well, I wouldn't call myself cold. I'm gonna be cooler because <laughs> compared to you guys, I'm I'm not gonna nowhere near what that is. Okay. I saw a couple of advent calendars at Michael's that I, that I wanted to get. They're real cute. But they're only 70% off and, and regular price is 60 bucks. I'm like, I ain't paying that much money for that. So if they, if they still have them when they're 90% off, I might get one. <laughs> but who knows? Oh, we, got, we forgot to paint the little door. Would you like to see guests um, come along with me or ju just let's just be quiet and, and craft? I'm using my heat gun so we can speed this up a little bit. I will have to see what's the schedule, Robin. We can't we can't plan ahead that much. That's a thing about working several jobs. Love you. you baby. Be careful. All right. I do my best. <laughs> Robin said we should do a do a, a special love birds um um live. Oh, I love you, Nancy. <laughs> yes. mm. Ooh, la, la. Okay. Okay. That's enough. <laughs> I told, told you we have to wait wait to see what your schedule is like. 
may be too exhausted to do anything. Robin says, bye, Earl. Bye-bye. If, if you hear the washer going, it was me. Me, yeah. sure. Do you need me? Do you need me to put anything in the dryer? I put my best in the, in the, in the washer. But you don't need to, me to do anything. Do you need that? Oh, the washer drying. I'm mean, washing right now. Yeah. Okay, because I don't hear it. Very, very quiet washing machine. Yeah. Okay, it just sounds. Yeah, it sounds um. Not loud. We have to think of some DIYs for next year then. My plan was to have some easy DIYs, 20, 30 minutes tops. It, it hasn't worked that way out. So, so I'm not going to even try to do that. So we'll just start DIYing and wherever it takes us, it takes us. It's taken me three coats so far. To cover these little guys up. Like I said, I would, I, if anything, just buy some gingerbread color clay. But you know me, this this season, I was not going to buy anything extra. And then, like I said, this gingerbread was um not planned. So. I used what I had in my stash. You'd be you'd be surprised once you start, you know, saying I'm not buying anything else. What else can I use to make this or that? Yes, I went and bought some yarn because I want to make a little gingerbread guy. I saw on on Facebook. He's too cute not to make. I know it's not going to be ready for Christmas. But he's still cute. So that's probably something that I'll, I'll do for myself to next week when I'm relaxing or trying to relax. Okay, I think I might need four coats, guys. Yeah. And so for some reason there's a little little air bubbles or something or some polymer clay that got stuck on top. But we'll cover it up with some paint or whatever. The chat stops. What happened? What you guys doing? Eating? You didn't invite me? What the what? The, the last few days, or, or actually, we started early in the week. We, 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 we've been watch, going watching some old movies that we haven't watched that came out years ago. We started watching uh, Maze Runner and finished it today. Not exactly what I want. I wanted to see some of the stuff. Well, you know, Mike, it's not going to be Nancy. Nancy not going to go live. Unless Nancy wins the lottery and says, Hey guys, bye guys. No, but well, you have to um, play the lottery to win, right? Um, 
So if you don't play, you don't win, right? Is that how it works? Okay, that looks better. So it, it took four coats. I'm sure if I used chalk paint, it would have gone faster. But I don't have chalk paint this color. Again, I'm not buying new stuff. I'm going to go as far as I can with what I have. Unless I get a custom order, and that's the only time, <clears throat> excuse me, the only time that I would I would do that to buy stuff. I had a custom order, and I went, and she gave me the deposit. Hi, Chris. Merry Christmas. She gave me the deposit, and I went and got the yarn. But when I started the project, it, it, it was harder than I thought it was going to be. So I refunded her deposit. It wasn't her fault. I'm the one that canceled it. And guess what? I have all that yarn that, that cause I, I didn't go back to return it. Cause it was at Hobby Lobby that I got the yarn from and Hobby Lobby is uh, on a good day is about an hour away. <laughs> so I did not, I still have it. So I might do something with it or de-stash it or who knows what. Whatever you want, Robin. I forgot that I need to um, paint the sides in the bottom here. I'm thinking to myself, why is it so still so warm? Duh! I just hit the hit it with the heat gun. <laughs> and now our, our neighbors are shooting fireworks. Like you guys know, it's not the Fourth of July or New Year's, right? Poor doggies. Poor doggies get all crazy when when stuff like that happens. I need to, I, ha, I have another bottle of those little fine tip um glue bottles I have. I want to if putting this inside the 3D paint inside those little bottles would would make it work cuz I would like to use it as a, a more of a precision pre, precision tip. But um I'm not sure where I put that little bottle because I had several. So right now I'm just doing the, the, the side so when I do them together, it gets all covered. Any interesting movies that, that you would suggest Yes, I used to, I used to do things with with pine cones, but you know what I did a few months ago when I was cleaning up my my stash, I threw away the pine cones I had because I had them for about five years. So I'm like, well, why keep them if I'm not gonna use them? So then Christmas came along, I was like, wait, I could have used them for the for, oh well, oh c'est la vie. Okay, we're going to. I'm might you. I'm going to use um the Dollar Tree metallic white marker to de to use to decorate. See how that looks versus the puffy paint, because sometimes the puffy paint looks a little too globby globby. You know what I mean? Globby globby globby. Okay. 
Vem inte då. But I can't live my life like that, Robin, anymore. Because I'm running out of space. I'm seriously running out of space. I ha I'm I have my desk all full, right? Right now I have a, a, a small ottoman, storage ottoman here to the right of me that is filled to the top. That if, if I hit it, everything's gonna fall. It, it, it's just too much. Life is too short to, be, to have too much stuff. So I, I just need to um Uh, Chris, she, she's into the clothes pins now. I think, have you done anything with pine clothes this year, Robin? Well, I don't know, was pine clothes at the end of last year, or? I don't know. My days in, in, in months um, blend in. I'm going to go wash my hands real quick, because I have... Icky, icky paint all over me. I'm still here. Don't go away. I'm still here. There we go. Got most of it off. Okay, let's get some strip. No, I, I said we're going to decorate first, right? So we're going to move this. We're going to move this guy. Hold on. Um, you go right there. We're going to move these guys off. I don't want to get any brown paint on my white once we do this. do this. Now I'm going to open this guy up and fold him the other way. And use the other side. Ta-da! Now I won't get any paint. Oh, that one, that, that squeezed that a lot. <laughs> so we're going to stick these guys here. That's the roof. The side panels. No, oh, we don't want that. Um, did you guys see where the little door went? Little door. Little door. Hold on. Seriously? I'm looking for the little door. Some little door dot that disappeared on me. Hmm. Did you guys see where the door go? Went. You guys good at good at, at seeing things. Hmm. The door disappeared. Did it go down? Oh, there it is. It went to the ground. There we go. It just flew down to the ground. Okay, we're going to get my white gel pen and my Crafter Square metallic marker. This one's in white. Let's see. That one is from Dollar Tree. And this one is a jelly roll. I'm not sure where I got it from. It came in a three pack. I had it now for a few years. Like I said, all my stuff is, it's not something that, that I just, come on. Uh, I don't like it. Oh, well, that's a gel pen. I found the Gina, it was on the floor. So we're going to, let's see, 
I think I may get you. Let's, let's start in the back. So we're going to make little swirls. You might have to do it several times to get the white that you want. And I'm not doing any pattern. I'm just having some fun here. Like I said, this this white pen from Dollar Tree, not very um, how you call it, opaque. So you probably have to do a few few um, few turns. Let me see how the the jelly roll works. I want to put a couple windows back here. What I'll do when I put them together with the super glue, I'll use the 3D paint to put it on the sides, like if it was icing being put, having assembling them, even though we're not using the icing for the for that exactly. Oops, that's off centered. Oh well. I'll put a bigger ledge at the bottom here for a windowsill and some some snow I guess maybe with the, with the with the 3d paint I'll do the bottom once I put it all together we'll do that add some more at the bottom there and here we're gonna just add some dots and stitches. Hi, Steve C. Welcome, welcome. Thank you for coming. We're decorating a little mini gingerbread house made out of polymer clay. I'm holding it down here so I can do a little circle here. And like I said, this is not very opaque so if you want opaque you may have to use paint or the puffy paint but like I said the puffy paint to me um, looked a little I don't know for something this small you needed something with a little more delicateness Don't ask me what, what I was doing with the circle in the middle here. It doesn't make sense. But it's there already. Or I can make him a peppermint with the, with the red puffy paint. There we go. I'm making him a peppermint. So here's the back wall. We're going to add some red to that. That one dries up to make it a peppermint. Now for the, uh, let's do the the roof, the roof line. We're just going to draw some lines here like this. Hi Herb, how are you feeling today?
Okay, we're gonna let that dry and do the second coat. I may do, you know what? I'll do it right now. This is gonna be a peppermint, peppermint um, roof. So we're going to add more lines so we can put the red in between. And you don't have to be very precise. This is a gingerbread house. Like I said, that's going to dry. I'm going to let that dry so I can do um, a second or third coat of the, the paint marker. Or the metallic marker. I would do the paint marker that I have from Hippie Crafter. But um, it's a big nib. So it's, it's not going to be... Um, I see it's not going to be delicate either. This one is not not so delicate either, but it's better than the, the other two options that I have right now, which is that that paint marker and uh, the puffy paint. That's good. It's not good being sick. Okay, we're going to put that to the side, let it dry. And now we're going to use the jelly roll for the front because I want a little bit more detail in the front. Let's clean this up a little bit. Like around the door, I want to just put some stitching. And this pen is much better at that because it's so, it's, um, it doesn't say the size. It says Sakura, 10 Sakura. So I don't know if that makes any difference. I should have done this stitching in the, in the back. But it's in the back. If anybody wants to see the back, that's fine with me. But I like this stitching. Gonna... There you go. Let that dry a bit, and then we'll do this one. Do this, the stitching around, and then we're gonna put some windows on the side here too. Too, I didn't get too, too close to the edge on that one, so that, that one looks a little weird. Weird, but once we put the puffy paint, you know, things will start filling in. This is where you can get creative with whatever you want to do on these guys. You don't have to use white pen; you can use a different color pen. So now we're going to make some um i'm gonna make a big old picture window on this side i wish i had green paint because I, I can i can i can draw a, a little tree on on the side window maybe with some gr actual green paint I'll, I'll paint it we'll see or just do a little window pane the two lines across, like the side, the back windows. Get the other pen. Oh, we got twelve watching. Thank you, guys. Hit that thumbs up if you haven't already. I appreciate you guys spending your Friday with me. I'm sure there's other things you you could be doing. I hope that that what I do here um 
how you call it, inspires you to do something. It doesn't have to be a gingerbread house. It could be just, just getting some paper and drawing some pictures. Just get creative. Okay, we got the windows in. I'm gonna add some little swirlies. I should have used this pin on the back because, like I said, it's, it's a little more delicate. I'm going to do a little snowflake back here. Little dots. I've added another coat of this. There's one side wall. If I have better, better, better supplies. I probably, you know, who knows? I may make another one next year and see how 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 my pro my process and my progress has changed from one year to the next. You know what I mean? Okay, Robin. You guys can start dropping some hints or ideas for next year. I'll start writing them down. And we don't really have, to, you know, most, I, I think all, all by, but one has really um, been Christmas this time because we got that polymer clay turkey coming up soon. But it doesn't have to be Christmas. Just some DIYs. Um, what are you having, Miss Gina? I'm using my little pokey tool to hold this down because it's so small. We get, I'm just adding some red puffy paint in between the white on the roof. Just to give it a little extra color. Like I said, it's not even. I, I watched this, this this crafter. She says, we don't do perfect. We just have fun. So this is... I don't want to... I have to be careful. That's the roof right now on one side. It's got the red in between the white. We're going to put that one to the side. I should have waited to, you know what? I'm going to wait for the, the red on this one because um, when we glue it together, that's going to be wet still. So I'll, I'll wait for this. I'll do the red when I glue it all together. Like I said, you know, going on into the new year, I, I'm not worried about numbers. I was getting stressed out. And like Steve Steve from Harnell Needle, Harnell, Harnell, Harnell Media said, uh, you don't get rich off of YouTube. So, so why worry? You're, like, you're having fun. Just have fun. Who knows? Maybe one of these days, you know, you you, have, you get one of those viral videos. But in the meantime, just have fun. No, I haven't made. 
you you want to see something? Is it here? Hold on a second. I'll show you. I'll show you Miss Constant Constance. I've been putting some some notes together here. Let's see where where are we? Was it here? Was it another another notebook? It was another notebook. But I have that on, on, on one of my notebooks. And I also have this that I want to make out of Jenga blocks. Not sure how I'm going to make it, but we'll see. So I've been writing things down. Did you win a, a, a tape measure, Chris? You didn't send me an email. I can send you something if I don't have an, a, an address. I'm looking to see where I had. I guess I don't have it. It must be another notebook I have. But I have a lot of notes in here. I still have the, some tape measures, so send me your address. If, if you, I'm sorry. Let's do something here on the front. Okay, my, I had this open. There we go. It doesn't look, look like a tree. <laughs> oh well. God, is, is my is my chat stuck or no one's talking? Okay, once I glue them together, then we'll add the red. No problem, Mike. You gotta do what you gotta do. What do you mean by a farm, Gina?
Is this dry? That's dry. Okay. Fingers crossed. Oh, we need to we need to add which way is it? This way? The bottom to the window sills over here. I mean the bottoms of the windows. Oh, he's looking for his own. I thought he, he he won one from me a few months ago. I wasn't exactly sure what he was talking about. Cause I, I I could I could you know lose some time. What units are apes measured in, Mike? Um, monkeys? I don't know. A girl, you're. I only have about two hours per day, unless unless I do a piece of the farm every day. So, so we're going to turn this around. Go get the side window, the side walls first, and. I'm using the, the super glue gel. See if that works because I know hot glue is not gonna it's not gonna look right because of, of the gaps. So I thought maybe the super glue gel might work better, but we'll see. I can do a manger. Did I put this right? Yeah. Let's let's start a list. A farm. A manger. This is for twenty twenty-three. Um, I super glued my <laughs> my pencil to my finger. <laughs> Ow, 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 oh, okay. That, that, that felt weird. <laughs> we can do something like a, like, like the, the, a, a farm and I put this, the glue on the wrong side. Do like a, a piece of the farm every day. I can look into something like that. Okay, we got those two sides. See, that's the thing with this. They changed the formula for this super glue. Because before you can stick to anything. And now it's like, well, if you want to stick to that, it ain't going to work. There we go. I'm going to take them off the parchment because the parchment is a little uneven. So we're going to go over here and open this up a little bit. Okay. Now we're going to put the walls on. Here we go. The other wall. And we're gonna hold it up for a second. I'm trying to see if it, make sure that it's square. Or at least close to square. For some reason that it it, it, it got it got baked like a like a <laughs> like like a gingerbread because it's not it's not flat. So we're going to press it for a few minutes here. Let 
Okay. We'll leave that for alone for a second, and we're going to put some little stitches on the door. You got to do a little, a little, little window, right? And then put little stitches. Oh my. I guess when you do two projects, <laughs> it takes a little longer. I gotta be careful. I think I only have five hours left on StreamYard this month. And I still have tomorrow. Okay. Okay, now we're gonna. See how we're going to do this roof like that. Okay. Just going to do on the sides. It's not coming out. There we go. Okay, and it's stuck to me. It's stuck to me. Help! Get away. Okay. So far, so good. Bring it up a little bit over here. There we go. I might put some hot glue on the inside <laughs> when it's all said and done. To give it some more reinforcement because the, the, the side wall, uh, if you can see, for some reason I, I should have put something on it to um when it was cooling. This one right here. Uh, uh, come on. It's not flat, so it's not really touching the wall. So I'll probably put some hot glue there. Now we gotta be careful with this one over here because I already put the red on here and it's still wet. So my little gingerbread house is a little wonky. Wonky. We'll put the glue over here instead. Put some glue on top of here. I don't know, this thing might fall apart. I'm gonna lift this up very carefully because, like I said, I, I should have done the red after I put it up, but we're just going to see what we can do here. Okay, that's not going to work. I need to slide it down. And we just fill, fill that up with um, the 3D paint. Thank you, Liz. It's it, it's getting a little wonky. Let's see. Not too bad. It looks like a little doggy house. <laughs> That's what it looks like. So now we're going to um, add the the red paint over here on this side on the roof. Since it's on already, I hope that nothing falls off. And you can use paint, you don't have to use this. I mean, uh, that's what I have.
do their gingerbread stay up? Because every time I've made gingerbread, they, they, you know, after a while they just fall apart. I'm not sure what I'm going, what I'm doing wrong. I'm tr see if you can see me here. I'm, I'm trying to do this white little thing back here into into a peppermint somehow. Just doing the red paint and swirling it. I'm definitely going to get some some faux sprinkles and peppermints and stuff next year. There's that, that little peppermint. Cuz um Okay, that thing does not look right, but hey. It will do. I'm just adding some accents here and there with the red. Oops, that that one got, got a little out of hand. Hey, Mary Kay. And before we go any further, I am going to reinforce the inside with some hot glue because it's falling apart. One moment, please. I'm just, where the seams are, I'm just adding some hot glue. Because it's really falling apart. And I don't want it to fall apart. And I'm trying to see where. Okay, I didn't put any red there, so turn it around this way. I guess if you're gonna eat it afterwards, it needs to fall apart, right? But we're not eating this one, so we need to it to stay together. Okay, okay. See, it's just a little wobbly. I'm going to put some on the roof. Put some on the roof here. We're going to cover that with the white paint, so that should help it. Now we're going to get this little door. Rubber bands. What kind of rubber band? What are you talking about? Cut rubber bands, cut them up, take rubber bands. Um, I'm confused. Oh, we need to. What we're going to, um, what we're going to do here? The little door. There we go. I'm just ah ah oh, dang it I forgot about the red on the roof I just got it all over my hand and I, mess, I messed up on the white so we're gonna have to fix that I'm trying to put the door here but I want it slightly open Hey Robin, welcome back. I'm using hot glue on here. Let's see if that works for the door here. Like I said, I want it slightly open but not closed completely. I, I, I say open, not closed. Come out. Come out. Oh well. See where up. And I messed up the peppermint. Dang it. Nancy's not paying attention. See, I messed up the roof there. And I messed up the peppermint. I have to wait till that dries for me to fix it. Oh well. Let's finish the the frosting. I'll put some on the top here. I'm 
OK? Let's see, where, where do I have red on this side? OK. Now I'm going to add the frosting on the sides to make it look like a, you, you put the, the gingerbread together with frosting. And I use the, the cookie cutter, and for some reason, the front of the house is taller than the back. How is that possible? I do not know. You see, I don't know if you, I'll show you. See how the this is the front? See that roof line? And it's it's not there's there's no gaps in the roof, so I, I guess the cookie cutter is a little off. And it's funny because this side over here looks okay. So I don't know. I'm gonna put some over here and over here. Nice. Are you timing me? No. Okay. We're almost done. It's been two hours, mommy. Like what? You're gonna add some some, some snow at the bottom. Yeah, little snow drifts. I think that that'll look cute on the bottom. Like I said, I'll fix the peppermint and the roof line later. I'm going to put some over here, too. Put some on the side here. Oh, that looks cute. I'll try to fix. Right handed. I think I need a new bottle of this by the time I finish all my all my DIYs. Here we go. The back. Okay. This side over here. Ta da! Let me get a um, piece of card. Here we go. It's a plastic. That'll, that'll, that'll work. You know what? We're going to do this so I don't tilt this guy. <laughs> There's the front. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Jeez. Come on. Oh, well. I'll put some pictures up later because it's not wanting to focus. There we go. There's this, the one side. There's the back. I'll, I'll fix that peppermint once it dries because I can't touch that red because it's, it's wet. And this is the other side. I'll, I'll fix that roof once it dries too. And then back to the front. You see the focus the front the front now. There we go. And there's the, the little door. So once it, that all dries, I'll fix whatever needs to be fixed. So there's my little gingerbread house. It is, I'll tell you the size. I'll keep it on this little tray for now. It is two inches deep by inch and a half tall by two inches wide so it's two by two by one and a half let's um close out all this stuff up before it dries up we don't want no paint or glue drying up that was fun 
And, um, oh, no, I didn't. Ah, uh, uh, dang it. Dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. I messed up the skate by putting my notebook on it. See, I, I'm running out of space. I have no place to put anything to dry for it to... I'm going to have to fix that somehow. Let me get the other skate so you can see the the non-messed the non up one. There's a skate we, we did while the, the clay was um baking. So I got paint on me. The, the other one's all nasty now. Jeez. <clears throat> this I'm going to have to put it somewhere where I really can't mess it up. Because it, it might fall apart on me. So there's the little guy. My little gingerbread house. How, how big is he next to the little gingerbread people? Do, do I have a... Hold on. I think it, if I make a ging, one of the little gingerbread guys, it's, it'll be too big. I know I had an extra one around here somewhere. Here, he, here they are. I haven't painted him, but he, he's way too tall. This is how big the little gingerbread guys are. <laughs> so we'll, we'll we'll find a spot for it somewhere. I don't know what to do with it. We'll see. So that's over. Oh my goodness, two hours. So until next time, I appreciate each and every one of you coming on. Excuse me. Close my pen up before it dries out. So what? Uh, this one I'll have to wait till tomorrow because um, the the puffy paint takes a while to dry and I have to fix it. Thank you, Liz. Twelve o'clock tomorrow noon Eastern because we're doing tw day twenty four and twenty five, and I and I can't make it at six o'clock tomorrow. Yes, I can do it. Add a, add an ornament to it. We'll ha we'll have to see how. Oh, I could I could put a little um screw eye on top. I have some screw eyes that I could put on top. So he can he can hang in my my little mini tree, cause it's it's not. I have to be careful, but I think it'll be the perfect size for a mini tree. So um, night everyone. So until next time, be brave, be strong, and create something sweet. So I'll see you guys tomorrow at noon Eastern. Bye-bye.